Hey friend, I am Ajit. Today's drug review is Sucralfic O. Sucralfic O is a contain Sucralfet plus Oxytacine. This Oxytacine that is a local anesthetic. And if you see the composition of the Sucralfic O, that is each 5 ml contain. If you take 5 ml, in that 5 ml you will get Sucralfet USP 500 mg Oxytacine BP means British Pharmacopoeia 10 mg in a flavored palatable basis quanta sufficient and they are used coloring agent Tartrazine this coloring agent is nothing but other than API means other than active pharmaceutical ingredient and if you see the dose as directed by the physician and uh, storage condition is stored in a cool dry place protected from sunlight and uh, keep out of the reach of children and that is the schedule H drug schedule H drug means the pharmacist should not dispense this drug without prescription that is commanded schedule H drug and there is a batch number is there and manufacturing date expiry date MRP minimum retail price and that is mainly used for peptic ulcer if you want to know what is meant by peptic ulcer this is the peptic ulcer diagram normally ACL is secreted from parietal cell normally ACL is secreted from this parietal cell and it is the mucus protective layer of stomach and this is the stomach when excessive ACL means hydrochloric acid is secreted that time it get uh, inflammation in that uh, mucus layer and that causes peptic ulcer in shortcut form and that uh, ulcer generation is uh, happen because of excess ACL secretion and this place is going to implant in this place because of excess secretion of uh, ACL, this uh, mucus protective layer is going to damage and it uh, leads to ulceration formation in that uh, um, mucus protective layer. And that time, if you are going to take that antacid, that is antacid is uh, aluminum hydroxide and magnesium hydroxide. These are used as a antacid and uh, if you see that uh, that time we are using another drug that is called proton pump inhibitor see in our stomach release ACL if you break down ACL ACE plus CL minus this is otherwise called proton see that is channel is there this proton is there unable to enter into cell so that is called proton pump inhibitor proton this proton pump inhibitor this proton unable to enter into the into the extracellular membrane so that is proton pump that is uh, comiprazole we can use Pantoprazole you can use and uh, Ishmoprazole you can use for proton pump inhibitor. And uh, we are going to revise one time that is drug for choice for peptic ulcer that is Sucralfic O. Sucralfic O it contains Sucralfate plus Oxytacine. This Oxytacine 
is a local anesthetic see oxytocin it oxytocin is local anesthetic and locally relief pain means uh, suppose inflammation is happening here inflammation it uh, if you use that uh, oxytocin if you take oxytocin suspension local pain relief it will help to relieve pain in locally and you can uh, along with we can take uh, antacid that is uh, aluminum hydroxide is there magnesium hydroxide is there and one more important things that is HCl our parietal cell is released HCl the HCl is going to break down H plus Cl minus H plus we otherwise called that is proton and it is channel is there that is intercellular means that is extracellular and extracellular this, uh, this is the proton this H cell is there is breakdown H plus and Cl minus that is the proton and this is a channel this proton is unable to enter into the from extracellular to intercellular this is why called proton pump inhibitor proton pump inhibitor example of proton pump inhibitor omeprazole pentaprazole ishmoprazole thanks for watching